And welcome back to the channel. RP here. Thank you so much for letting me steal some of your time. Taxi Life. Mixed reviews. This game is terrible. This game is horrible. That's what they're screaming. I'm a little bit late to the party, so we're not going to do the tutorial. You guys have probably seen the tutorial a hundred times already on YouTube, so let's just get into the game. I've already gone through the tutorial for you guys. Uh, it's just basically, you know, hey, go here, stop here, park in this green box, do a U-turn. Uh, type of tutorial uh, not that not that hard but very long and uh, very boring so we're not gonna uh, do that so we're right here in the game now I will let you guys know I am using the steering wheel uh, okay so big complaint that I heard right off the bat was I wouldn't even be able to use my steering wheel uh, I can and looks like a car coming up now I could get rear-ended right now because that's another part of the uh, complaints in the game let me go ahead and switch on my lights here, hopefully. <laughs> All right, I got to turn the car on. I'm using, like I said, my steering wheel. There we go. There's my lights. Go ahead and take off the parking brake, and let's just get out of here. So it did recognize my steering wheel. I did not have an issue. I'm using a Logitech uh, G steering wheel, and... Yeah, I haven't had any issues uh, with that. The issues that I'm having in the game are just AI issues, and I think that's what everybody is uh, kind of, uh, you know, talking about. Let's go down this street here. And, like, I have seen some, like, right here, like some real crazy AI pedestrian movement. Like, you don't know what this guy's going to do. Go ahead. Go ahead. Thank you. And the streets are narrow because this is uh, Barcelona, Spain, I guess, right? So you've got a lot of narrow streets, but I'm used to that. I live in uh, Boston. <laughs> if I want narrow streets, I'll just hit the north end, baby. They don't get any narrower than that. But anyway, uh, so what we'll do is we'll pick up a fare. I'll show you guys how this works. And like I said, whoop, whoop. And you just have to, at this stage of the game... Uh, you just have to be super careful. I mean, straight up. Just be super careful. All right, so what I'm going to do before I get down here, this car is behind me. I'm going to go ahead and get on my map real quick. And let's see, where are we at? i got to find the car. Where's the car? Hello. Hello. Where are we? I have no idea where I am on this map. All right. Nope, I don't want that. Oh, here I am. I'm right here. All right, let me get rid of this. Whatever I did. I want this guy right here. I don't want this. Can I get rid of that? Okay, I got rid of that. I'm going to click on this guy. He's going to be my new fare. Let's go ahead and we should have a green box up here. Let's go ahead and pick this guy up. And I'll show you guys, uh, you know, what it's like to deliver a customer in the game. Uh, I have, pl oh, what is going on here? They want me to parallel park to get this guy. All right. Uh, I got this guy right behind me. Come on, pal. See, so this is going to be impossible, all right? The AI is right behind me. The only thing I can do is go around the block. All right, get off the, get off the sidewalk. There we go. All right, this guy has a patience meter on my GPS, as you can see. If you use turn signals in the game, you'll get, like, extra points. Oh, right there. I just hit, uh... <laughs> it's tight. Just hit a pole. Probably damaged my taxi. All right, so this is, this is, uh... This is a tough pickup here. Stay there. And right now, this is what the game is, man. It just, like, throws a lot of... A oh! Throws a lot of AI at you like this. All right, you got to be careful. If you see them on the corner, and if I start going, they're going to walk right out, see? So, yeah, you have to be super, super careful. Um, Look, if they fix this stuff... Oh, dude. Dude. <laughs> If they fix this stuff, the game could be good. 
Uh, but, you know, if you're going to have a game like this, this AI has to be a little bit more than just running patterns back and forth on these uh, piano bars here and calling it a day. You know, you got to have it a little bit more like real life. Now, well, you, why would you walk? Look, look, look at this. Look at this. This, fix this, all right? Tell everybody, the developers seem to be uh, caring that their game is kind of getting, you know, bad reviews and everything. But look, look, people just want, you know, people just want the game to uh, work. You're going to put out a driving simulator game. Number one, it has to have good driving physics. And number two, the AI has got to, uh, has got to cooperate. All right, I don't have any cars behind me. Let's see if we can uh, get this uh, done here. This is going to be a tight one. But, hey, I live here in uh, the city, so, you know, this is just a normal type of parking job for me. Oh, there we go. The only thing I don't like is my brake is not set independently. I have to hit the brake again to get into reverse. And that part I don't like. I can change the camera. So I can get an idea of where we are in this box. And, uh, yeah, look, I gotta hit the brake. Whoop! Oh, I just hit that car. <laughs> All right. There we go. This should do it. There we go. Hi there. Hi there. All right. That's the hardest pickup I had right there. And like I said, if I could get this uh, brake to just brake and then be able to uh, switch to reverse and still use my gas pedal, uh, that wouldn't have been as uh, ugly. <laughs> Trust me. Uh, but right now I have it set on arcade settings. I tried to set it on simulator and see if I can get independent brake and throttle and reverse and I could not. So basically what I'm saying is I just stopped and if I want to go in reverse I hit the brake again and then hit forward to stop and then forward to go. So if I can get that fixed you know be able to control uh, stopping and not going into reverse afterwards. Now she's gonna cross the street again watch. You crossing? What are you doing? <laughs> Uh, but I definitely find it a whole lot easier to use a steering wheel than my uh, game pad. All right, so this is nonsense. All right, this is nonsense. This is just holding things up to hold things up. So, can you open the windows? Can I open the windows? Uh, yeah. Okay, let's open the window here. Thanks. All right, no problem. All right, that's the first. Now, can I get out of here? Hello? Okay, let's try this. Look at this. This is perpetual street crossing. We're going. No! See? <laughs> you do not need to play this game to know what this game is about, folks. <laughs> I will. I will show you what this game is about. All right. Here we go. Now, do I still have my passenger? I do not. All right, so let's go ahead and pick up another passenger and let's see if we can uh, get this done. I'm going to, here, there's someone right here. Let's go pick up this person. Maybe they'll be a little bit easier to pick up. But uh, yeah, guys, this is, uh, this is a, an honest playthrough of the game. And this will tell you everything you need to know about how the game is in its current state. And uh, you don't need to uh, suffer the hit to the wallet. I already took that for you. But I still, you know, I still like to show these games. And I still like to, uh, yeah, what are you going to do? Walk right into my car? Go ahead, walk into my car. See what I, see if I care. All right, let's see if we can uh, go pick up this, this fare. 
like I said, it's got a, you know, the idea is awesome. The execution is just not there yet. This thing is, is totally, totally, uh, not ready. All right. This thing should not have been released yet. The AI needs to be in, uh, in better, uh, better form. All right. This orange area right here, I can go in here. This is a garage. I can line my car up into this and I can, uh, repair i can get fuel uh, i can do all of that stuff i can also get fuel at a fueling station and uh so that's about it right and then it's the green boxes to pick up your fares and i wish i wish it worked because a lot of us were looking forward to this right now, that's an easy pickup right here i put purple lights under the cab hey <laughs> Hey, how you doing, buddy? So you from around here, my man? Or are you just visiting? Oh, all right. Well, you let me know if you want to chat. I'm here for you. Let me try to get you to your destination, and uh, perhaps we will not go down a street with pedestrian uh, craziness. You know, maybe we can get on the road and get out of this little neighborhood here that's very, very tight. All right, use the turn signals. Oh, uh, get up. Get, get, get up on that sidewalk. All right. So there's the patience meter. Now, look, you know, I, I don't know how. We have these speed bumps everywhere, right? Everybody has speed bumps. No matter where you live, I'm sure they're, they're pretty common. That's smooth enough for you there, buddy. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Ah, uh, come on. I'm going. There. So it's like a um, an unnecessary hindrance in the game. I know you have to have pedestrians crossing the street, but you don't have to have it like uh, like this crazy. You know, like come on. Never going to be able to get anywhere because everybody's going to want to be crossing the street. You're in the street. Get through. It's like it's like dodging them. It's like timing them and then getting through. You know, it's almost like uh, like the uh, the Frogger game, right? I'm trying to hop from <laughs> from piano bar to piano bar. All right. Come on now. Now that gosh, I got to go all the way around. To get to look at look at where he gets dropped off the street that was just uh, behind me that must be a one way uh, the other thing I I am starting to see is I didn't know if there was night to day changes now I started this uh, career it was during the day after the um, you know after I could get out of the road hey dummy All right this is how I drive in uh, <laughs> in real life <laughs> All right. Uh, what was I saying? They completely derailed my uh, my commentary. Uh, I'll think. Uh, I'll, I'll think of it. Uh, yeah. I, oh, that must have been a one-way street. I think that's what I was getting at. All right. So they, these little uh, gray uh, things on the GPS there—that thing that looks like a pill or a little. I don't know, it's gray. There's another one to the left. Those are, are areas of interest, and when you go by them, uh, you may get a, a uh, alert to acknowledge it and discover it, and that will add some points. And you do have a uh, skill, a skill tree. Uh, right now, we are actually getting extra points for something. It's the first skill I took. I'll show you guys that before we end the video. Come on. Go! Oh. Let's go. <laughs> uh, well, it doesn't drive badly uh, with the steering wheel. I have force feedback. I can feel the force feedback. The only thing is, like I said, I'm in this arcade mode, so I... Oh, come on, dude. Come on, my man. Gonna turn around and go back the other way? I'm going now. This is it. 
you guys tell me what you think. And, uh, hey, I hope everybody's uh, having a great weekend. This is the weekend for me. Checking out Taxi Life Simulator. And, oh, 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 oh. Almost missed my turn. Let's just back it up here. That was not good. That was not good. His patient bar is still okay, though. All right, another parallel park situation here, but let's see if we can uh, see if we can do it like this. Let's kind of crawl in here like this. Turn the wheel, and boom! Bye. Bye. That's it. All right. Let's see what he did. What do, What do I get? How many stars? Four stars. I got a tip. All right, so now we are in this, uh, we just dropped this guy off. All I got to do is hit X on my steering wheel, and we can continue right from here. We picked up a hey, passenger man. right here. Hi, how are you doing? How's things going? I hope everything's going well. Uh, let me get you out of here. There's something big on the window. Is Use there? Wipers. I will. Just give me one second here. All right, she wants me to hit the wipers. And I'll do that. And how I'm going to do that is I'm going to hit the uh, tab button. And I'm going to hit the Q until I get to the wiper. And this slows down time during this whole process. So go ahead and hit the wipers. There we go. How's that? You happy? I hit my wiper. I'm not getting acknowledged that I hit my wiper, but go ahead. Let me go ahead and turn my wiper off. This, I wish I could turn the wipers on with a uh, quick key. And maybe I can. I, I, I just haven't gotten that far in the game. Would be nice if one of these uh, X, Y, A, B, or many, or, or, or the other buttons on my wheel that I could assign the wipers to. That would be nice. Maybe I can, but I heard that there was no way to assign things, but I actually assign the uh, turn signals to my paddles instead of having them set for gears, because I have a shifter. I have my paddles on the wheel set for my turn signals. There you go. Dive right out there. And just keep walking. All right, let's see if we can keep this patience meter a little bit... Uh, a little bit higher. I don't know what constitutes, uh, you know, her patience being tested, but normally when she told me to wipe the, the windshield, I would have got a an acknowledgement from the uh, computer saying, or from the game saying that uh, I made her happy by doing that. We did not. So even though we performed the task, it did not acknowledge it for us, so... That could be why she's not too happy right now. All right, here we go. See if we can get her to where she's going. And I hope you guys are enjoying this honest playthrough of the game. And uh, this is this is how it will play for mostly everybody right now in this state until there's some patches to address. Uh, the wonkiness of the AI. I'm finding that I'm getting more AI issues with pedestrians than I am with the cars. To be honest with you. At this point. Not saying that I haven't been rear-rended. I have. I can attest to that. That is a alarming bug. <laughs> when you're just sitting still, not doing anything, and all of a sudden, bam. You're in a pileup. But uh, other than that, look, if they could fix this stuff... Man, this would be a nice little game to play, a nice little relaxing game to play. Just make it work. You know? That's all. So hopefully they will. And, uh, you know, in the meantime, I'm, I'm checking it out. Like I'm saying, it, can you play it? Yes, you can play it. But, you know, this video, I believe, is showing a very good, honest... Uh, view of how this game performs in its current state and uh, I hope you guys are uh, enjoying it and I hope you can uh, evaluate the game nicely from uh, what you're seeing here because I'm basically just going to drive us around 
you know, we're going to do this fair, maybe do another fair, and I'm not going to edit this video because I don't want any, any cuts. I want everything to show so that you guys can see what's going on here. All right, so this is a rotary, right? You need to get into the rotary. Come on. Thank you. All right, so now you're getting a chance to check out the uh, AI traffic with me. Oh, man, these lights are bright. Oopsie, I went in reverse. Come on, buddy. Come on, pal. What the hell are you doing, dude? All right, so there you go. This is what it is. Over on my left is a speed camera. So we want to make sure we're not speeding when we get up to this point. There it is right there on my left, the gray icon on the uh, GPS map. Whenever I talk about things that I'm pointing out, they will be on the GPS map there. Just so you guys know. All right, this is a full-fledged rotary right here. Doing a complete 360. All right, patient bar is still looking pretty good. Make sure we get off on the right, uh, the right road here. This one right here. All right, I know this guy right here isn't going to go anywhere. I'll tell you that right now. I can feel it. Just want to be able to see the light. All right, light's changing. Let's go. Come on, everybody. We can do this. All right. Good. I'm out of there. So, yeah, you have to watch your speed limit. You, you basically have to try to drive as smooth and as li nicely as you can for your customer. And, you know, get them there on time. Now, one of the things I did do is I set my brake. Uh, you could set the... Um, uh, the sensitivity. I sent... Get the heck on out of here, buddy. I got to climb up on the sidewalk for this? Oh, here's something right here we can get. See? We just collected that. Get out of that that area. I got to drop my client on the sidewalk here. There you go, ma'am. Goodbye. How'd I do, ma'am? How'd I do? I got five stars. All right, good. We did that one well, and we could take another one. See, this is what I like about the game. I don't have to actually go searching for fares. Like, the next fare is right up here. So it has that automatic, like, let me find you the, the closest fare. So you can just, like, rock and roll, make some money, you know, without having to, like, really... Now, I'm, I'm not enough in that box. Now I should be. All right, and you guys saw there, we discovered hey there. something. Hey, what's going on, buddy? How you doing? <laughs> you sound like you're in a good mood, my man. I like that. Uh, I, I have some bottled water back there, sir, if you care for a drink. Uh, and uh, there's the, today's newspaper is there as well. Please uh, help yourself to uh, my complimentary uh, peanuts that are in the pouch right there behind the seat. There you go. You just uh, sit back, enjoy yourself, and uh, let me get you to your destination. All right, we got some good patience with this guy. Now, what's the speed limit here? I haven't seen any signs. Whoa, oh, we got a little bit of a bump. I hope this doesn't uh, upset you, sir. Nope. Patient stayed still. Good. I got a car right behind me, which makes me feel very bad. <laughs> All right. We got a green light. Let's get it. Let's get this light. Let's see. Okay. You just stopped right out in the middle of the road. There you go. But like I said, man, I'm from Boston. I know how to deal with that. Not my first idiot in the road. Okay. Oh, it's 70 here. Really? 70? <laughs> I, I don't think so. Oh, 
I can never see the lights. Let me see. Okay, the green. I got to stop further back so I can see the lights. Or they need to lower them. But it's difficult to see them. Now, look at this guy changing lanes left and right. I got another point of interest, but I'm not close enough to, uh, to trigger it to uh, be able to get the credit for it. All right, this guy's going to be making a right hand turn up here so let's go ahead and uh whoop didn't want to do that sorry folks my bad i'm trying to uh change my view so i can look over to the right i forgot which one of these um buttons uh turns my right hand to look over to the right basically so i could have checked my mirror all right, back in the tight streets, and we'll drop you off. Your patience is looking good. You're either a very patient person, or I am just nailing it on the driving here. All right, we're just going to go, right? Oh, yeah, dude, come on, come on, come on. I need. I got a short window of time here, my man. Thank you. All right, let's get going here. All right, we'll drop this guy off, and I think, uh, you know, I think this is a pretty good... Uh, overall gameplay video that shows you exactly what you're getting. You, you do not have to, uh, you don't have to guess at a thing. This is, this is a good, what, 30 minutes of gameplay we got going here? Uh, that'll show you, that shows you everything that you need to know to make a decision on whether you want to be a taxi driver in this game. There you go. Get Bye. out. Goodbye. Now, how'd I do, sir? Your patience level was excellent. All right. We are getting some points, which is nice. We got first step. Successfully complete at least 10 rides. And uh, what I'll do before we end the episode is let's go to a garage. All right. Let me go ahead and acknowledge this escape. Let me hit the map. And where is the closest garage? That would be right here. All right, let's go to this garage. And uh, I'll show you what that's all about. And if you do like this uh, video and you'd like to see me play more of this game and as the developers come out with patches, and from what I understand, they're really aware of what the issues are. Now, whether it gets fixed or not, that's something we'll have to wait and see. But I, I am 100% confident, based on what I've read, uh, they do know what's going on. And they do want the game to be successful. And, you know, if they, if they do the right thing and they put the uh, effort into correcting uh, the uh, things that are really an annoyance in the game, then they'll have a nice little game here. You guys let me know what you think. Don't forget, hit that like button. And, uh, yeah, again, thank you so much for hanging out with me. I do appreciate it. All right, this is the first time I've had a little breakdown here. Pretty cool. Look at this, a little car accident. Not bad. All right, now, dude, this, here we go again. Crosswalk from uh, hell, right? Hold on, buddy. We got people here. We got the, uh, the guys in the orange stripe. Oh, man, come on. Black stripes. Orange stripes. I'm going. It, this is it. It's just like, you know, it's combative driving. You've just got to get, get it done. You just have to get it done. All right, let's see if we can get to this garage. It doesn't take me too long. I won't cut anything out. So you guys can see all the driving. Oh, what the heck? I'm, I'm putting this thing up raw. <laughs> you guys are just going to see the whole thing. Every glitch, every mistake, every uh, every time I hit the wrong menu, the whole thing stays in. All right, garage is on the other side here. We just have to uh, head down here. Uh, then first time we get a chance to go make a Yui. We'll bang that Yui and uh, yeah, we'll head to the garage. I might pick up another uh, another point of interest too. I see one along the way. Your company finance report has been updated. Q 
Keep it going. Your driving style increased. All right. I haven't been speeding. I'm obviously not speeding. It's 70, and I'm only doing 50. Uh, oh, and like, oh, I know what I was saying. I, I, I set my brake sensitivity from 50 to 80, and that seems to uh, have made it easier for me to brake. Oh, oh, I just missed that. Dang it. I'm going around. I'm going around. It's a rotary. I want to get this. I got to get this, man. I'm going back around. Can I get it from here? I want to get this. Let's get this before we uh, head to the garage. We should be able to get it on this go around here. All right, one of these go arounds. Come on, where is it? Really? Well, I don't know how that works. How, uh, how, where you have to be in order for, to, uh, in order to pick up the, uh, the ability to, uh, discover it. And we went by an area and we did get a, a small flash of the A button. All right, let's just get to the garage. I'll leave that for another, uh, video. If we do another video, you know, again, that depends on you guys. If you want to see, more of this game on the channel hit the like button that's how it works all right oh 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 oh, oh, oh. there 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 <laughs> oh gosh too many crosswalks if you ask me paint some of them piano bars black you don't have to have a crosswalk. You could have a crosswalk at a street interchange. You don't have to have a crosswalk every five feet on those narrow streets that we went down. You know, it's like jumping from one uh, crosswalk to the next. All right, here is the uh, a garage. How am I supposed to get into this? Hold on, right here, I think. Let me see if I can maneuver this. These streets are super tight. There we go. Here it is. This is actually a pretty easy garage to get into. Let's go ahead and check this out. All right, so now I press A, and here it is. So we can go ahead and just do a complete repair of everything. Fill up our gas. And then we have our driver, and we do have one point, so we can do economic driving, or we can do proficiency. Uh, that takes less time to do what we just did here. We can have lower maintenance cost. This is all about the freedom, you know, XP. This is all for your drive, obeying the law. We can get a free ticket. We can get uh, uh, fines from photo radars, take less money. And then our company drivers cost less money. So I guess we get to hire drivers as well, which is awesome. I don't see any management. Here's our statistics. Uh, we've discovered some monuments. Uh, we've had some unique conversations. We've bought some parts. The parts are the, the colored lights, by the way. I bought two of them by accident. We've completed 10 jobs. Uh, I don't see anything about me, like, uh, hitting pedestrians, so I guess that's a good thing. But, yeah, and then you've got to help over here, and then back to the garage. All right, so let's get out of here. All right, folks, I think that's going to do it for this episode, and I uh, do appreciate you guys uh, letting me steal some time and hanging out with me. And again, if you do want to see more of this uh, a taxi life, a driving simulator, then just hit that like button, drop a few comments, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Ta-ta and bye-bye.